Welcome back to another makeup tutorial. We're doing Maddie Perez from Euphoria, such a banging show. So if you want to see how to do all the things, uh, keep watching. All right, so we're gonna start off with primer. Uh, this is just like an hourglass primer, I think. Like the ones that you get in the testers from Mecca because that's too expensive to buy. So we're basically going to focus on the last photo I showed of Maddie, like the purple eyes with the little diamonds there. I think that was just like such a good look for her. All her looks are good. I just, I love this show. Like the makeup and the fashion was just like, ooh, ooh, very good. Sweet. Alright, so we've just put on our foundation. Now going in with concealer. This is Colourpop. Uh, I think the second lightest colour because your girl's pale. So you just want to blend that out to create a little bit of dimension on your face. Pretty. All right, cool. And then setting our face with hourglass setting powder. It's pretty stock standard, but it's good. If you have oily skin, it won't make your makeup fall off during the day. Now for eye primer, this is Urban Decay Eye Primer. It will just make your eyeshadow stay on longer. Now I already contoured my nose off camera because that is a whole ordeal on its own. So now I'm just contouring the sides of my face to make them a little bit more heart shaped uh, like Maddie's. Okay, now uh, a chocolate bronzer. Maddie is super nice and bronzed and I'm just here looking like I'm 58 and sick. So yeah, we're just going to add a little bit of colour into our face. So if you do like on your jawline and also the uh, contour parts. We're just going to define everything out and give you a little bit of life back. So I just bronze at the top of my forehead, down the sides, starting at the side and then blending towards my mouth. It will make it a lot more natural if you start from the ear and then go down. Now for blush. She wasn't wearing a whole lot of blush. Uh, her face makeup is actually pretty natural but she doesn't need anything so that's fine so I'm just gonna add like a nice sort of natural nude also hourglass can't remember if I already said that not sure yeah and you just want to blend that sort of more closer to your eye to, than then to your ear rather than right on your cheeks and now I'm just adding a little bit of pink just to give myself a bit of color I'm looking a little bit washed out or it could just be the overexposure on the camera I don't know Sweet. All right, on to eyebrows. So I'm missing quite a lot of my eyebrows, so I'm just gonna pull a little bit forward, make them a little bit more elongated and sexy-like. So I just start with like a cool toned gray color, and then you go all the way along. I didn't really copy her eyebrows for this, just because I did not think they would suit me at all. I probably should have given it a go, but Ah. The general idea is more like the eye makeup and the diamantes and all the accessories later. You'll see. You saw already in the intro. <laughs> Sweet. And then I just darken that up with a little bit of black on the end to match my black wig that I'll be wearing. And then obviously do underneath this bit of concealer if it's not quite correct. Wig cap time! This is my black wig from Muse Gates. I can link it in the description below for you if you'd like. It's pretty decent, doesn't tangle, which is nice. So I'm adding some lip liner, that's hot. And a little bit of lip gloss. Lip gloss looks really bad on me. Um, I ended up changing this lipstick anyway to something purple. So <laughs> don't mind me. Yeah, I sort of played around with it a lot. I guess it's good to sort of experiment on your own, see what you like, see what you don't like. And yeah, you can change it if you figure you don't like it anymore. And now I'm adding the rest of my highlight to my nose contour. Just going to make it look a bit cuter. Jawbreaker! I was so excited when I got this palette. I love Jeffree Star. Cool, and then we're just putting a white base on our eyelid. So that we've got... Mm. I don't know where I put this in, to be honest. Anyway... Purple. You can pretty much just get away with like purple, but I wanted to put in a little bit of blue to give it some pizzazz and like a nice sort of base. So you just really work this over the whole eyelid, not going up too crazy far, but just sort of, yeah, in the middle like that. 
and then yep the purple color so when it was blue first and then yep purple so purple I usually start on the outer corners and then go in but you can really because you're doing it over the whole eye you can get away with starting in the middle or starting at the tip or the front sorry and yeah now we are an e-girl there we go I just added eyeliner and lashes and I also changed my lipstick color to a purple not too sure how I feel about it rewatching the video but eh, you can just discuss it however you like <laughs> okay now these are little face diamond tees I got from La Visa I've just used eyelash glue and I'm using just a regular pair of tweezers to stick them on. You can always add more or less or add some around your eyebrows. Also looks really cool. And they do stick on really well. Um, I wore these out for like a whole night out and they just stayed. So pretty decent. Now I'm just going into the corner of my eyes to give that sort of sexy effect. When you put the eyeliner in to make more of a cat eye. I was in struggle town with my wig. Beautiful, there we go. I put some earrings on, now I'm gonna bling it up because Maddie is all about bling and being extra. I love it, I love her. If you haven't seen the show, uh, please go watch it. It's amazing. My t uh, the first episode was a bit eh, like Tumblr posty, but then it got really great. Sweet, now we're just putting in these little hair clips for the final touches. I'm just being super extra. You can add however much or however little you like. And there we go. We are done. I really like this look. I think it's really different and just really, I felt hella like feeling myself when I was wearing it because it's so strong lady. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, have a go. See how you like it. Accessories make a big difference. And yeah, just have fun. Thanks for watching. If you want to do a subscribe, that's cool. If you don't, I'll come find you and we'll still be friends because that's okay too. <laughs> Alright, thanks guys. See you later.